Okay, friends, here's another idea and tips on decorating. This is a buffet cabinet that I have. I actually um, did a DIY on it and I used chalk paint and did a navy color on it. So I think it turned out really good. Here is a before of what my buffet cabinet looked like. And I'm gonna show some clips of, I took it apart, took the doors off, the drawers out, and I did about three coats of this milk paint finish and navy color, got it from Menards. And then I did a couple coats of a chalk paint uh, top coat. So it was super easy. Um, anybody can do this. It's a great way to save money and reusing the items that you have in your home. I would love it if anyone who has chalk painted furniture before would um, comment below. You can do an emoji, like a heart emoji, a raise a hand emoji. Um, and let me know some of the things that you guys have chalk painted and how that turned out in your home. I love it. So here, um, this is a runner I've had for a very long time. Just has some different colors that I use and that kind of match my fall decor. Um, and it has a great texture, a different, um, gosh, it's probably like over 10 years old. So I just love using that for fall. And this lantern I got from Hobby Lobby. I just put in some battery light candles um, and some faux pumpkins and some leaves. So super easy, change it out for the different seasons. Um, just very easy decorating idea for you. And if you guys want me to take these apart and kind of show you how I do it, please leave me in a comment below and let me know if you want me to kind of start from scratch like I did on my pie safe and show you how step-by-step -step to put this together. Also, I have this other dough bowl. This is from Hobby Lobby. It's a white color. Um, and in here, I have different textures, different sizes of pumpkins. These are some great Sherpa pumpkins um, that I'm using in here. And I just pile them up. And actually, my daughters have been using them and then putting them back. So these are some faux maple leaves that are at Hobby Lobby. And I just kind of, um, they're just, a stem of them and actually my daughter Ruby did this she laid them down in the tray and then um, yeah it just gives you a great texture and a nice base to put the pumpkins on and this is a battery operated um, kind of grapevine pumpkin I actually got this at a thrift store for three dollars it had some other greenery on top and I just clipped them off with wire cutters so this was a great deal because Hobby Lobby is selling theirs, I think for like $19. So three bucks, I will take it. So yeah, you just kind of, um, you know, put these in however you want. Um, just make sure you don't have like the same color um, if that's not what you're into. I kind of like the different colors, but maybe you want it to be all white or all orange or um, whatever you want. So I like the different colors, the different textures. And there we go. And then, you know, you can always change it up. And then here, I actually, this was on a stem and I just cut it off. It was like one of those mother pumpkins I have in my arrangements. And I propped it against this vase that I have. Got this at a wholesale, actually a discount warehouse. It's a Target um, vase. I got it for um, $5. Sorry about my lighting. And then I just stuck some, actually my daughter Ruby stuck some, um, different floral items in there, different floral pieces. And sorry, I keep casting a shadow. Um, so yeah, easy fall decorating tips for you. And this is just on top of a buffet. And this, um, if you're wondering, is from Decor Steals. I think from their spring box a couple years ago. It's actually a boot tray. And I put it on our wall with command strips. And I love it. it. Just gives a great, breaks up the wall, breaks up the tan color. Um, yeah, so I just love it. And make sure, you know, just as I've been saying, use the items. It doesn't have to be what it says it's for. Like that's a boot tray and I put it on my wall. 
Thank you friends so much for hanging out with me, um, doing some decorating um, tips for your home. Um, I'm so excited to share some a living room decorating and then how I decorated my kitchen um, with you guys. So stay tuned for more um, decorating ideas for fall. Thank you so much for watching and be sure to like and please subscribe to my channel, um, Home with Ashley. I am trying to get to a thousand subscribers by Christmas and I am so excited to share more decorating tips for you. Thank you guys. I hope you have a great weekend.